Hey, my name is uh, Andrew Carter. I'm 17 years old. Um, I'm born in Tennessee, and I was raised in uh, San Antonio, Texas. Um, during my early childhood, my dad was really associated with basketball, and um, he really wanted me and my brother to do basketball. And, um, uh, in my family, he didn't really want anything else to uh, be involved, like which is like football, boxing, um, things like that. So um, my my, uh, my older years, I started like aging and stuff like that, and and being a part of like the Washington era, there's a lot of boxers and stuff, and um, they really showed. They really took me to the gym. We started boxing and stuff like that. And um, one day, I just came home and told my dad, hey dad, can I do boxing? And he said, no, no way. And um, basically he just kicked me out because uh, being associated with basketball, he didn't want his kids doing anything else. So um, I, took that, I took that in the back of my head and said like, he basically doubted me. He said, no, I'm not paying for boxing. And, and I, I got so furious, I just put it in the back of my head and said, all right, all right, we'll see. Um, my family uh, knew that I was, um, Playing basketball a lot, like they knew that basketball was associated with me for my like basically all my life. And um, when when I started telling them that I was doing boxing now, they they kind of um, uh, doubted me. They said, "Wow!" They laughed at me and said, "Wow, you're doing boxing!" Like they, they didn't really imagine me doing boxing. And um, most people from my school, they they really uh, judged me and said like, "Oh well, um, like you're too small to do boxing. You're gonna get knocked out and stuff like that." And um, I, I kept I kept I kept quiet and I kept humble. And um, I just kept that in the back of my head and used that for me. And, and when I and when I saw um, when I came to Seattle and um, came to Cappy's Boxing Gym, I, I really uh, knew that it was something for me. They they granted me a scholarship my first um, my first month here. So I was like, like I looked at myself. I said I really could take this to the next level. Keeping in mind that everybody doubted me and and, and using that to and to strive for success and uh, be, being able to do good, like giving all my like 110% of what I got in the boxing ring. I'm now a part of the Cap East Boxing Gym um, amateur amateur boxing team, and um, I'm really getting prepared for my first fight. Um, I've been I've been at the gym. I usually go to the gym around like five days a week, um, training um, three hours or so, coming back home training. And um, my friends and my family they they really like. Um, because they know I'm doing, I'm going so far in boxing. They really like starting to get on my team, and, and they they really starting to starting to show up as if they were like at my beginning years where they wasn't there for me because they doubted me. And um, I mean, it, it really has helped me. Boxing has really helped me. Um, my anger that I had in my early years, um, it, it's really helped me to uh, take my anger out. Um, it, it's it's made me happy. The people that's that's here is really social, and, and they'll really get you. Uh, they'll really get you a nice workout here. And um, I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't take advantage of it at all, man. I, I'm here five days a week, um, training, giving, giving 110 percent, going, trying to go to the next level. From my story to yours, I'm Andrew Carter. I'm 17 years old. I'm more than just a basketball player.